me just say. That's your reply to what I'm going to say. No, you're just going to say, like, no, that's a new one told story. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hey, is that story over told? Fuck no, baby! That's a new one told story. Kyle, what episode is it? We starting? Uh, th- no, that's just how I typically talk to you. <laughs> yeah, you would be like, "All right, you ready? You ready? Get your mind right. Get your, mind just... right. Get your mind right, Kyle. Get your <laughs> I, that, mind that right, sounds like something I'd say. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You ready? You ready? Yeah. I'm gonna crack your back. I'll be great. It's 297. 297. Yep. Getting closer and closer to our Indian guest. Uh, a lot of people guessed it. Who it was yeah. out of all the options? Out of all the uh, billions of options. <laughs> billions. That's right. It's Sanjay Gupta. Uh-huh. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Off the top, I was trying so hard to think of another one <laughs> besides Maresh Patel. Sanjay Gupta is Sanjay uh, Fr- Frida Pinto. Uh, yeah. Dev Patel. Um, yeah. So uh, the segment was polarizing the weekend update. So I think they don't like pre-planned stuff. So I think we should do more like improv weekend update. I'll go first. <laughs> Same <right>. joke again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going to do that every week. <clears throat> oh my. Breaking yeah. news, Kyle. Oh, God. oh, and former Trump lawyer, Michael Avenatti pled guilty to stealing 10 million from five clients, including a paraplegic man. Avenatti's life has really gone downhill since 2018. We can only hope the paraplegic's life goes downhill, too. It'll be easier that way. (laughs) (laughs) Did you hear about this, Kyle? Uh, How to murder your husband author sentenced to life in prison for what? what? Murdering her husband. If stuff like that comes true. Well, let me stop you there. I I thought for sure that that headline wrote itself as a joke, but let's see what you add, yeah? If things like that come true, look for my new book hitting the shelves. Dude gets his dick sucked. (laughs) (laughs) You weren't even bragging about a good (laughs) blowjob. You could have said dude got got his dick sucked by a 10 out of 10 model. Excuse me, I'm talking. A handful of Arab countries have banned Buzz Lightyear for having a same-sex kiss scene. Pixar shouldn't be too shocked, though, based on their history. Last I checked, cars bombed over there. (laughs) (laughs) Wait, wait, wait. Let me go off that one. Uh, 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 These guys are trying to... uh, They're trying to get a fictional toy out of here. Uh, They're worried about catching the wrong buzz. They don't even drink alcohol. (laughs) They're so boring. They should go drink some booze. There we go. But they're worried about a same-sex kiss scene. Uh, Remember, the Sunnis are always kissing other Sunnis. Weekend update. They're worried about a same-sex kiss scene. I thought Sunnis were allowed to kiss other Sunnis. Yeah. Good work, man. An ex NYPD cop fired a gun into the Atlantic Ocean. He got six months up to or four years in prison. Uh, when uh, asked, the officer pled ignorance and he said he thought it was the Black Sea. It's okay to shoot if you're a cop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. You're going to like this one, Owen. Inflation rose 8.6% in May. It's the highest it's ever been since 1981. Who the fuck gave this economy an everlasting gobstopper? <laughs> That's the candy Violet Beauregard ate in uh, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. That's right. That's right. That's right. Um, A major tampon shortage has struck the U.S. Women are enraged, men are disgusted, and sharks are fucking stoked. When women swim, there will be be blood in the water. (laughs) Yes, yes, Uh yes. Uh... An elephant killed an elderly woman and then went to her funeral and trampled her corpse. You know, Kyle, in some cultures, that's considered good luck. (laughs) Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You want to piggyback off? Feel free to piggyback off of any of these. Uh, 
I read. I also read about that article. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you it's read about funny. the article, yeah. so you read the title like I did. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I clicked for the title. second line of the article. She was tossed out of an open casket. Yeah, flung. Yeah, by an elephant <laughs> <laughs> that had originally killed her. <laughs> There's always like other cultures, like you know, in some cultures that's. Yeah. 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 Uh, Trans Jeopardy winner Amy Schneider threw out oh, no. the first pitch oh, no. <laughs> for the San Francisco Giants for uh, for Pride Month. Good, one yeah, commenter said uh, it was one of the bravest things they've ever seen. Looks like there was a first inning stretch that game too, Kyle. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there we go. Uh, I didn't finish this joke. I'll let you finish it. Okay. Uh, happy birthday to Kevin McHale. You may know him as the gay glasses wearing wheelchair bound singer from Glee. You is Kevin <laughs> McHale. You <laughs> I was going to go something like while some people wanted an actual gay wheelchair bound Glee club member to play the part. They've all killed themselves. <laughs> <laughs> Bullying. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But again, we're both going off the cuff there. Uh, I don't want to assign a winner or loser. Um, Owen has them too. Uh, you can go next, Kyle. No, you skipped again. <laughs> um, Barstool Sports headed to Sonoma Raceway mm. for one of the biggest NASCAR events of the year. Mm. Uh, fans, this is over the weekend. Fans got a chance to meet and experience the race with Barstool's very own Casey, Kelly, Cons, Large, and Spider. Cons, Large, and Spider sounds like me describing a tarantula. In my home. <laughs> I skipped through the no pros to that. It's just that was the, the biggest cons it's about this the big the tarantula in my home. You're at one? Um <laughs> No, no, I think that was pretty good, man. That, you, what right, else you win again, Dick. <laughs> Go to the news. This is my favorite thing we do. Let I don't know. Let me go to the news. So. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> so, wait. Uh, <laughs> Brazilian police have denied reports that bodies were discovered in the Amazon belonging to a journalist and an indigenous expert. If you want to deny an Amazon search, you should probably delete your search history first from the website <laughs> because it's right there. It's very easily accessible. Uh, it's it's hard, one of the most hard popular to deny. websites in the world. You hard can, to deny if I it's can, right yeah, there. So don't deny that. Weapons, explosives. Wait a minute. I got one. Uh, the Amazon is the, the longest river. Uh, <laughs> it's the shortest river. Is uh, uh, River Phoenix. Phoenix. He's 5'8". Six feet under under. <laughs> That's right. He's negative six feet tall. Yes. Um, he's the shortest. He's the shortest not, river. Not, not uh, the other rivers that are in contention for shortest river. <laughs> Certainly it's yeah, him. So, yeah. Not the Amazon. They're merely creeks. <laughs> Tributary. That's right. This is good. Yeah. yeah, it's good. I think it's a good brainstorming. I think Should we do Mount Rushmore shortest rivers. Uh, yeah, it's got to <laughs> <laughs> Weapons and explosive found in Michigan home after bomb blast. What do you think? Pretty bad. Par for the course for Detroit. <laughs> that one might be on SNL. I actually wrote one. <laughs> one that. dead, one critically hurt in shooting between family members outside Atlanta Hospital. Knowing those dumb motherfuckers. No, in Jesus, no. <laughs> no. In Atlanta, they probably were waiting for an ambulance and then he bled out. They were, he got shot outside of a hospital. <laughs> Probably waiting for an ambulance to arrive. That's how he died. <laughs> Do you have these written or are you just reading headlines? I'm reading the headlines. Uh -oh. <laughs> Gasoline glitch. California station sells gas for 69 cents per gallon. The joke writes itself yep. in here. I have one I didn't say if you want to read the top one. <laughs> the Rolling Stones had to postpone some shows because Mick Jagger has COVID. I wonder how he found out. Maybe he couldn't taste the brown sugar. <laughs> he could no longer taste black pussy. <laughs> <laughs> you have a, a few. What is it? Which okay, one? What is the Pentagon one? Oh, yeah. Read that one, too. 
The Pentagon has ended the long-standing restrictions on service members with HIV. Looks like the spy who shagged me can be re- can be rebooted as a horror now. <laughs> That's a good one, Kyle. Fuck <laughs> play too (laughs) you had all week a group of men disrupted a drag (laughs) queen storytelling you just can't do it off the a group of men disrupted a drag queen storytelling at san lorenzo library by shouting homophobic slurs maybe they should have whispered them (laughs) got the point across better (laughs) it is a library yeah that's right yeah it really drove home the point that what they were trying to make it would have been i'd argue more whispering efficient. that to somebody's way more offensive they just want you to hear yeah, it it would be <laughs> people should start yeah if you have to say it you should whisper it. whisper yeah you should whisper use your inside mm-hmm. voice what's up nick you wearing any uh band t-shirts of rapists <laughs> wait owen has some wait, uh, well, chill wait yeah you are <laughs> 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 oh, man. Have you dis- have you have we discussed this wait, in any way? No one has some. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh. Let's let's talk about the T-shirt. All right. Uh, Monday, I let's, came let's in. Set up some history. I like music. I like bands specifically. You you said last episode you like band T-shirts. Yeah, I did. Mm-hmm. And I You're have bought good. an influx of them. And uh, I bought one of a band, Dance Gavin Dance band I've liked. And you had no like maybe you didn't have any like hint that they could be rapists they had to throw a guy out once but they they took the Their action and they threw him out is what the, the history of all rock vocalists are that rock yeah okay so you wore the shirt on monday wore the shirt on monday uh he was accused of uh some things with some or th- this was thursday it was thursday yeah that's right yeah and he was accused so i wore it on thursday and it's it's you were in a lot of content that's publicized i was in the uh, the yak the rundown a lot of uh, a lot of a lot of stuff and uh he was then accused of doing some things to a uh some people or person it's you know it's i haven't delved too deep uh wednesday the day before so that's a pretty bad look on my part so the next day you wore there you supported their band (laughs) and i got like a dm many many views a lot of eyes on that shirt. A lot of eyes on the shirt. And I got a DM that was just A lot just of weird. clickies <laughs> want to know what you're wearing, what weird your interests hit. are. I got a DM that's just like, weird hill to die on. I'm like, what are you, what? You didn't get enough shit for that. I got a lot of no, shit in my I was DMs. searching. No one gave you enough shit. I got DMs. You should You should have been canceled. I got one. My dad used to tell me that the most important day to, of the year to wear your Yankees hat was the day after they got eliminated. Shows so in show, that yeah. same yeah. sense, after your it, hero, I, I, I like the yeah. band, That's not the, the um. That's what you're doing. Not the singer. I don't support mm-hmm. the singer, but I got a lot of shit, and I almost wore another band she- shirt the next day, but I didn't want to roll you the like dice. Pop punk music, yeah, it's all it's a roll. Of the dance dice Gavin every dance day. isn't pop. What punk. are they? Rock? Yeah, it sounds like, like math rock. It sounds even. like pedo rock, pedo pump. No way. Get that look at the name. Dance, dance Gavin Dance. That's Ew. an awful name. That's like what that Vine guy was doing to that little five year old. Oh, he's he making Gavin. Him. Yeah, get bit by a lizard. I have no like moral hiccups with that, but it is, it's whack to like make a five year old famous. Oh, yeah. There's a new guy on TikTok that's making his daughter famous. Like, just they have a podcast together. Oh, I've seen that. Yeah. He's like the surfer yes, guy. Yes, he's a surfer guy, but their audio is better than anything Barstool's ever done, ever. Um, I got one, it was a really, really awful unhinged DM. I'm trying to find it. Uh, I've been getting those too. Tough times to be a dance Gavin. Dan- I don't follow him that closely to, I, to where I knew that it was just bad luck. And it also sucked. Uh, it was the first time I ever wore the shirt. So it did look like I was making a statement. Yeah. Like I saw what happened and uh. I went out. And bought it. Overnight shipping. Overnight yeah. shipping. Paid extra. Uh, it was bad. And I got one that was just like, oh, where is it here? Like, sorry, there's like a lot of lot of DMs to go through. Mm-hmm. Guys acting, asking for my Pokemon Go trainer code. That's on the subreddit. It leaked. Your trainer code? <laughs> yeah, my fucking trainer code leaked. Um, It doesn't matter, but they were saying yeah, that I... I was getting a lot of shit. Yeah. But you wanted me to get more Good. shit? Yes. It's too late now. It's a, the, oh, the, the windows are. It's not. The windows already passed. Okay. The windows already fa- far, far past. But 
Speaking of getting called out, you got called out. And I don't think you know it. How's it come? Why? <laughs> yeah. Where? Well, first of all, let me read this ad for Felix Gray. While I pulled up, why don't you? Well, it's already pulled up. Kyle, you and I love Felix Gray. Mm. You had that phase where you were wearing them constantly. I just ordered another pair. Yeah. I lost mine that they sent, but I, I, I'm i willing to pay for those. Yeah, exactly. Um, and you didn't even use our promo code, S-T-O-R-Y. I didn't. I didn't. Story. I'll, I'm going to say These that. guys should, yeah. the viewer. Uh, they make prescription, non-prescription glasses. They filter out 15 times more blue light. Uh, you got some, did you get tortoise shell this time? What pattern? You yeah. don't, you don't yeah, know what tortoise yeah. shell is? Green. No. It's like the brown with the speckle. Yeah. That's what I got. Yeah. Figured. Uh, and it's helped you out a lot. Uh, stylistically. Mm -hmm. Um, you don't sacrifice style for function. Check them out at felixgrayglassescom slash story. F E L I X G R A Y glasses, D O T com S T O R Y free shipping, free returns. Love them over there. Love you got them. called out. You can't, you can't call someone four eyes for wearing those. No, you can't. You can't. You know what else has four eyes? I'm you're probably going to do a word that has four eyes, but go ahead. <laughs> Civilization. <laughs> <laughs> Availability. Yeah, those are two good things. Availabilities and civilization. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is good. Um, what did I get called out for? The ref called you out. The ref that you said you don't like the on ref, the umpire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where did he call me? He out? made a TikTok saying Barstool Sports calling me out or keep my name out your mouth or something. No, you yeah. suck, dude. You're an umpire who's trying to put braggadocious videos of how fast you throw the ball back to the ten year old pitcher. <laughs> That's your thing. It's uh, dude. Yeah, I got a DM. I gotta find it. But yes, he called you out. That's, uh, that's on, on TikTok. a TikTok on a TikTok. On his page. Oh. Let's see here. Kyle's reacting to this for the very first time. But I've gotten a lot of DMs because you guys were like, Look you at sound this. like you're overreacting. Everyone hates he's my like response. A, he's a legend on TikTok. I don't like watching myself in any way. Yo, what's going on, y'all? I want to say, Barstools, thank y'all for... Don't take this route, pussy. thinking of me as a legend. I never thought myself as a legend. A lot of people say... <laughs> it's always it sucks to have someone do yeah. that. It's and he just, bodied you. It, no, he didn't. He bodied it's just awkward. You. No bodies. You just thanked me for calling you a loser. You don't actually feel grateful. <laughs> You're upset. So I saw that. vice versa. Come back at me. It's fine. I don't have anything against you. I think you're doing what you're doing is very whack. But there's people on TikTok that are doing much whacker things. This might be a Kyle. Not much whacker, but. This might be a Kyle centric episode because I have a few things. I have a lot of your funeral slideshows as well you can react to if you want to see those. What does that mean? Oh, you, the last episode, about we asked it, yeah. about people making you funeral slideshows. Mm -hmm. We can pull those up if the internet uh, there's works. There's not like any like funeral esque pictures of me on the internet or anywhere. So they sent me some. I got like six. Two of them are to headstrong by trapped. Uh, as it should be. <laughs> no mutual followers. It's two people that yeah. have. Headstrong. Oh, shit, that's fun. Yeah. Uh, so I guess that's the vibe you put off. Uh, and then we can get to that. You've uh, had a ton of trouble sleeping lately. Horrible. You've dude. been miserable. No one cares. You're on the press. People do care. People do care. Because there was I a thread it. on our subreddit. I haven't. I've, I've, or, I have not checked. I've. There was a thread on the Yak subreddit. It, yeah, I haven't looked. And they were like, how the fuck has this moron not th thought of jerking off before bed? That's Yeah, that's their option. Everybody's. I saw so many people. I got DMs that are like, tell Kyle he's got to beat off. I'm like, I'm not doing that. No. <laughs> that doesn't do anything. Sometimes it like makes you a little more tired. It like makes you feel like relaxed and relieved, but I don't even know. Every time I do it, I don't know. Problem. It was ever since I started, we started traveling a lot. It was like, a, it was, we weren't, we wouldn't travel and stay at the same hotel for a week straight. It would be a different hotel. Every Takes day. a toll. I don't know if that did it or the drug usage. I don't know. <laughs> Could be either yeah. or man. No, you're right. It could be. It's been awful. It could be sleeping in a much larger, nicer, well-made bed with cleaner sheets after an exhausting day of work. That could be it. Or it could be uh, ingesting <laughs> drugs. It could be either of the two. Yeah. So I've been doing one of those things and I'm sleeping. Okay. No, no. It could be, an, it could be either <laughs> of those things, not, dude. That's not, it's not drugs. <laughs> um, what are you doing? I'm fucking sweating because I'm withdrawing. <laughs> I'm finally <It's> sleeping. <laughs> That's all it is. <laughs> so I was like, put your phone in another room while you sleep. I was like, oh, okay, yeah. Or I could just stop doing amphetamines right before bed. 
<laughs> Are you on the precipice of a meltdown? No, no, I'm actually. I was. I was yesterday when when you're sleep deprived. It truly does suck, and I, I don't deserve any sympathy uh-huh. for it. Uh, but it there is a one good part is after a while it's your sleep deprivation and your delirium ha- uh, adopts an, uh, a euphoric. Trip. It's a third gear. We, we talked about third gear. Do, yeah. uh, did we? Mm-hmm. In private. Oh, okay. okay. We yeah, have yeah, conversations like re- obtaining to our own like personal lives. Yeah, well, I do yeah. with you guys all the time. Yeah, yeah. for sure. Yeah, yeah. I just um, I sleep well. Tell them about it. You just say them in the cadence of like a SNL segment, so we don't know if you're genuine or not. I, that is, it's a curse. That's the way I speak. <laughs> I can't tell if you're being serious or not. I'm breaking up with you. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't think we yeah. should uh, see each other anymore, mm. ever again. <laughs> okay, okay, weird brain. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Um, no. All right, you going to be you good now? Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I got it. I got five <laughs> okay. hours. And That's I'm enough. Fine. No, I'm good. It's not anxiety related, which is good. My anxiety reverse skyrocketed over the past few months. I had a panic attack last night. I'm sure there's a word for reverse skyrocket. No, Plummet. there's not. You know what it was? And I'm emb- I've been embarrassed to admit this, but it was starting the Sopranos. <laughs> I started wanting to be like one of the characters on this is pathetic. But you didn't want to be one of them. You just wanted to be. I was an original I character watching, in that world. I never really watched shows, and I started watching them. And David Chase is so good at writing the show that, like, and James Gandolfini is so good at acting that I truly believe Tony Soprano was a real person it, during the fifty minutes in which I was watching it. And I was like, I when he was, he, I just wanted to adopt his mannerism. And it's, you're watching it on your tiny ass phone yeah. too, and it worked. I started stepping out more um, confidently in public. Started like, I stopped doing those little quirky cowers that you do to people in line or what to service workers you, i stopped cowering to people <laughs> to service workers like, you know like you do it like oh i'm sorry you apologize, oh, I apologize for just constantly. something you don't even do that's wrong yeah it was it was the sopranos really i wanted to be like them and did, do you think it <laughs> 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 really yeah i was expecting you to make fun of me no no i'm always shocked like when helter skelter drove uh drove uh what's his name uh, Chapman to kill John Lennon. I was like, how could that affect somebody in that way? But I guess. And, and the worst part is like they, the characters were written to be like glorified losers with extreme flaws. Yeah. And I still wanted to be just like them. Sans like the, the mafia shit. Right. Yeah. So. So that helped. Stopping watching it helped. Or watch, watching it. Sorry. Watching yeah, it helped. Yeah. 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 So try it. So it's try you. That. You liked. The Sopranos without the mafia stuff. So therapy. No, I hated the therapy scene. I just wanted to see the characters interact with each other, like like boys, like when they were at like the the restaurant or the strip club. Okay. I just wanted to hear them talk. Yeah. Help me a lot. Fucking therapy. Okay. No, that's good to know. Um, that's why I'll never go to therapy. So I'll, I'll tell that story and then I'll get that response and then I'll. What kill response? I, I gave you a good response. You should have either really made fun of me or really. I'm trying to. Sold I'm trying to sit, sit down and listen, man. Okay. I'm sorry. Well, what's been your tactics? Because you have to have struggled mightily in the past. Yeah. Yeah. yeah no, I just. Uh, I'm more of a. I. I. I result to being a hermit. Mm. And oh. uh, I've done it about four times in my life. And I was uh, I was tiptoeing the line as of late. You told me there was a point pr- pretty recently where you were in Columbus and you you wouldn't even you would put you would hang up towels on your bathroom mirror. So oh, you I told you that in yourself. confidence. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're laughing no, at that? No, I, that's no. the darkest place no, I've, I've no, ever been. I, I haven't. I never resorted to <laughs> towels, but I, uh, to veiling the actual mirror. But I would just refuse to like. I would do it with the lights off. Or so brush my teeth. Brush in the shower. Sometimes you just don't want any reminder of you. Yeah. And you're always stuck in a reminder of being you. Always. Uh, oh, yeah. There's all, you can always look and down and see your fucking hands, um, which sucks. <laughs> you know, <laughs> that's all. Suck. My hands are a constant reminder to me uh-huh. of me. Um, but if it weren't for that, I'd be cool. I'd be chilling. Okay. Yeah. No, I lived. When I was in like my last year of Columbus, I didn't have internet like you, but I also didn't have phone service in my apartment and it was a, it was a shitty apartment. Yeah. Uh, and I was going to bed like every day, like as soon as I got home from work, which I left early from. Yeah. It's, I was chilling. That one was your Valley. 
by Valley your rock. Your oh, rock bottom. Uh, is this going to be one of those episodes? Yeah, uh, probably. Yeah, taking a few or let's, years. Let's go to, to the get news app and like off alcohol. <laughs> probably that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, news app you want to do? What was the worst part? Was, was it? Did you like? What was the worst part of that? Um, How, after you quit, were you were you suffering? Like the immediate week, like the first week. Yeah, I would say because that's like physical. When I was at my peak drinking, um, yeah, that the first week was especially after like a, a bender. What was your peak bender? drinking? Probably like uh, 2019. Like uh, you weren't here. Yeah, when I was early into barstool, when I oh. was like riddled with anxiety, like f- terrified of everything, and then I started being on the yak, and I just started just blacking out all, all the time. No, your mom said I saved your life. She told me that. What do you mean? I'm not. I'm not claiming anything saved my life. No, your mom said I did. I was killing my. No, I was, <laughs> I was, I was trying to. You just fucking <laughs> slowed down the. Process. Not so fast. It's not true. I wasn't blacking out all the time, but I was drinking too much and not doing anything healthy. And you'd wake up with like a film of sweat on your whole body, not like your hot sweat. Yeah, no, it's, it's a different like, type of tell sweat. It's, it's bad. It's bad. It's the bad guy. Yeah, it's like I'm cold. Uh, anyways, tell a joke. <laughs> See what I have in my notes app. Any jokes in the notes app? All it takes is one horny night to completely change my TikTok algorithm. Not a joke. I was just I was just thinking that. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Do you get? I don't get my girls shit, on my TikTok. My shit was. Things I liked, like people explaining geography and now it's titties. <laughs> and I had one horny night where they know, like, if you spend extra time on one like titty video, then you, all you get, and then it, you just keeps feeding them, like, all right, more, 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 and you you like go to their page, and they know when you like spend time on their page. So that's all I get now, and it sucks. So wait, pull up your it's TikTok. It's just girls with it's girls with big tits and ass, and they're just doing nothing in particular, and that's all I need. <laughs> that's all you need. It. They don't, they don't do. Uh, the worst is when they try to do something. Either do nothing at all. Don't so try. Don't, would you prefer or, it to be a photo? At least learn the choreography. A lot of them are just like doing half dances. <laughs> That's the gayest thing you've ever said. <laughs> ever. This is, learn the choreography. If you're going to be a titty poster on TikTok and do dances, at least learn the choreography for what you're does doing. That, wait, don't does, half-ass a oh, dance. okay. Just stand there and show your tits if you're going to do anything. Does, does, it, does it turn you off? I'm sure guys are worse. Does it like, turn you off? Point, yeah, when they do the dances horribly. <laughs> it, and it's, yeah, whatever. Uh, I just took a picture, picture of Chase Crawford, and I'm trying to ironically post it, but my... You just asked him for a picture? Oh, yeah. The boys is awesome. What else is he in? Gossip Girl. What, what does he look like? Uh, he's... What are you going to do with the picture? Well, so when I took a picture with Neve, I wanted to post it, but I, wanted, I had to do it ironically, so I did the friendship ended with KB. Neve is now my best friend. Mm. I'm just going to do the same fucking thing. People will fall for it. Hook, line, and What do you mean fall for it, Kyle? Not everything's a ruse. No, people just take everything literally. They'll think like, oh. Nick is actually best friends with Chase Crawford. Yes. It's believable. (laughs) No, it's not. (laughs) It kind of is. No, it's not. People believe that you fucked Catherine Heigl and I hated it. Yeah, that that was the most pissed you've ever been at me. I was like, Kyle, you didn't talk to me for like four days. I was like, what's what's the matter? And you're like, pe- pe- people just are asking me about you and fucking. They were. Katie. They thought you were fucking Kate, K- Catherine Heigl, which is made, <laughs> what? which is probably realistic. <laughs> it's not realistic it's, at you, all. You, She's if a married you start, woman. If you, once you realize your worth, you would. Re- yes, you'd be a danger. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I wish you would do. <laughs> damn, oh. you, you think I could. Damn, that was like nice. a really I've been slowly trying to pepper in like me like being really attracted to you. <laughs> like, <laughs> I started like two weeks. Did you notice? No. I've noticed a handful. A couple, like once every three days, I'll like pepper in a comment like how how sexy you are. With the ASMR? Yeah, the yeah. Act. You didn't remember that? Well, that was true. That yeah, was. That's what I'm saying. Oh my God. Making do, my work easy. Do the uh, game time app uh, ad for me so I can uh, upload this photo. Funny thing about Chase, he spells it C-H-A-C-E. That's, that's the funny thing about him. <laughs> Uh-huh. It's actually the scary thing. <laughs> His name isn't a verb. 
like um, it's on, a Kyle. ticketing app that makes yes, it easier. Yeah, we all, than we already ever. know what it is, so I'll skip all the talking points. <laughs> <laughs> I get right to the. I get right to the. Call. <laughs> You're right. The best ads, no words should exactly. be said at all. That's, yeah, it's like it's like mom and pop shops and like family owned businesses that don't have to advertise because everyone word of mouth. They know how good it is. It's like a Cheddar's casual. Uh, but cafe. yeah, all right. Um, Here, just point down. It is a ticketing. I'm app. gonna put the overlay on the screen. Yeah, just point down app. to it. It does. It. <laughs> it oh, what about the listeners though? Uh, <laughs> it is a ticketing app, and it's very good. Um, you can use it to go. Yeah, dude, you're crushing it right now. <laughs> what do you want me to say? You want me to use like a, a, a synonym for good? Yeah. It's, a, it's an excellent ticketing app. I think you just try to use a synonym for synonym in that first sentence. <laughs> I said thesaurus. Thesaurus eyes. <laughs> you were going to say thesaurus yeah, eyes. Was. No, this is the, this app is like, I feel like we're scamming them. Uh, maybe because we work there and they give us free stuff. And it'll be different for you, but they crack the code on how to score deals on last minute tickets. Um, if you're in a pinch and you want to go to the concert in 10 minutes, you can make that happen with game time. Uh, what's the best concert you've ever been to? Mine was probably Third Eye Blind, The Weekend. What about you? My first concert ever, 98 Degrees. Was your best? Oh, yeah. Because you were young. It was my first. Oh, they yeah. came out of the ground in like hyperbolic tubes. That is cool, yeah. And uh, I had NI on one cheek and CK on the other. Uh, what was the one Owen, you put in it? It down? was for Lachey, not myself. I wasn't going as a Nickhead. I was a literal Nickhead, but for Lachey. Yeah. And I had a bucket hat on that also said <laughs> Nick. I was double Nicked up. <laughs> I was gay. I was a gay boy. <laughs> we, know, we know. We know. What was your best concert or favorite? The one where you pretended to have Down syndrome? Uh, yeah, it could be the Sammy Adams concert. I pretended to have Down syndrome to get back into. What was, the, um, what was that? I got kicked out for being uh, too drunk, but I, f I flipped it back on them <laughs> by uh, pretending to have Down syndrome. <laughs> And claiming not to be Love drunk it. at all. That's what I <laughs> and uh, it worked. <laughs> if you can pull that off. All right. So, all right. Yeah. Um, yeah. This is all part of you did. This you, is all part of game time. He just um, he walked out of the event and then he t put his shirt on backwards and then just walked right back. <laughs> in. <laughs> oh, this dude has down syndrome. <laughs> put his shirt on backwards. My buddy Marcus Black. Misconception. They can dress themselves fine. My yeah. buddy Marcus Black went to a wedding reception. <laughs> in an, and he wore a uh, polo shirt. Does it call it? Should I finish the game? Inside they they out. already know what it oh, is. Oh, no, no. Go yeah, ahead. Give, yeah. him the, give him the promo um, code. You know, download the game time app. Go to the account. You go to the, the account tab. You can, it's up in the corner. Create a login. And then you can easily redeem your code. Use the code UNTOLD. That's capital U-N-T-O-L-D for $20 off your first purchase. Download game time. Last minute tickets. Lowest price guaranteed. Fantastic deal. The best deal. It honestly is. Mm -hmm. It is. And the, the ticket master and those other ones are scamming people. Uh, yeah, I don't get how they get away with that. It's got a monopoly on it. I don't know what game time's doing. They maybe they're some type of scheme. What? <laughs> they're Either not. Way, you might as well, Kyle, they're paying why not, us. Why not be a part? They're, they're the last ad we have. <laughs> In a good way, dude. <laughs> No, you a can't. Good way. I want to, one time. I'll never forget this. You're, you just are. You have to self sabotage. I'll never forget this. Things moment. are finally going good I'll for us. I'll never forget this. We're moment. finally getting some respect was, in the podcast was, it community. It was the Sheets in Kent, Ohio. There's two. The one by Holly Park. Um, the the ATM malfunctioned. It was just spit it. Whatever you said, it would spit out like so many twenties. We all just got a bunch of money and um, went on went along with our days. The the staffers that she didn't care. And that was that. That's a, that's a scheme that was good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, somebody loses in the end. If something good happens to somebody, it's kind of like full metal alchemist. It's like alchemy, Kyle. There, there can't be good without bad. There can be creation without destruction. All right. <laughs> I knew that would shut you up. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, it's, yeah it's, can we just be quiet for a second? I need to upload this picture of me and Chase <laughs> being dead serious. Onto what? Flicker? Yeah, dude. Okay. <laughs> what was Flickr? Uh, Flickr. Uh, it was a photo. It was just a standard photo sharing uh, website that 
took a dark turn, at least for me. <laughs> Why? <laughs> How did it take a dark the turn? The wrestling community took it over, and we would use it to trade and sell oh, gear. Didn't you buy a uh, Scooby-Doo? Uh, no, that was mine. I sold it on Flickr. You sold your Scooby Doo wrestling. Was, it was it was a grand system. Everyone had everyone followed the honor system. No one got scammed. Well, wrestlers we, don't have the ability to scam. I don't know what that means. They're dumb. Yeah. <laughs> no. Uh, Flicker, oh wait, how did it take a dark turn? I don't know. I just said that. All right. I need to pee. I got. I got a shit. Go shit. Take a little break. No, I don't. I uh, got scared the other day. I hopped on Photoshop and I forgot how to fucking use it. And I'm getting old. Like, I can't learn new technology anymore. It's getting bad. Oh, uh, yeah, I just already. You've given up? I'm giving up, yeah. Television, I can't use. You can't use television? I can't turn on TV. <laughs> they are so ridiculous. Wait, I mean, I mean, you can't wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Roll, roll, wait a minute. Roll. Right, what right. do you mean you can't turn on TV? You can't turn on televisions? What? <laughs> Are we back on? Yes. I ha I no, I gave up trying. You can't use TVs. Somewhere, I don't know, in the mid aughts, late aughts, they Televisions took a dark turn. <laughs> Stop saying dark. Turn. Then they fucking because I didn't have. I never had one throughout. Oh, it did. I never had my own. I'd use my roommates. <laughs> Everyone has like three remotes. That's not you anymore, to, dude. Then, now it's like one tiny. Now little. it's and you have to figure out which remote. Oh, it's not that it's one. It's, not it's that a smaller anymore. one. You have to push the top right button and then hold it down and then configure. Uh, conf you have to also configure yeah. the other button. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> and no. then you turn it on and it's all like static. And then you're like, how do I get to the TV guide? And then you have to, oh, you have to use the other button to get to the TV guide. Is that, that's how it was <laughs> for a while. When I was growing up, when I was growing up, you just hit one button. <laughs> it's not like that anymore. Now it's just like a now smart TV. <laughs> what are you doing, man? I don't use televisions because it's, they're so fucking hard to turn on. <laughs> It's one little remote, and it's I, just so intuitive now. Just get it's they're all smart TVs. Well, that's not everyone. My parents still have the old one with two remotes that you have to figure out which one to get, the smaller or the bigger, and then what button to <laughs> configure and what button to press. I don't fucking care. Is that why you're afraid I'm to switch I don't from use, your phone? And I, the, you know what? Fuck you guys for <laughs> guilting me to get a new phone. Your phone was dying no, as soon as I you unplugged this, it. This this phone is still always dying. It's always dying. It died on my because you don't. It, it died on my then. flight to Pittsburgh it, because you don't charge it. It then. died when I was at the wedding. Um, it, and it's too big. My hand's too small for it. My hand always cramps up, and I can't I can't like use my thumb to press top buttons at the top of the screen. So I have to use both hands. So when I'm holding a rail on the subway and filling out a crossword so that the girl next to me can see me I filling it out. I always try to get seen. Yeah. yeah, but I can't use one <laughs> finger. So now I have to like get try a pop to socket. Yeah, fuck it. Get a pop socket. Fuck it. Yeah, yeah. Try mine. Try to hold it. I don't, I don't like these. <laughs> You're just holding it like you typically <laughs> would without it. I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> this is klutzy. Yeah. <laughs> it's not klutzy. That. That's a bad fan feel. <laughs> They're the best. I can't live without it. And when I'm watching shows. Nice. Is my hand cramping up because it's too small for the or am I dehydrated or something? <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't think it's. E How do you hold your phone? Not, you do you were, put your pinky underneath like this. And I almost got the mini version and I was checking out with the mini at Verizon. And then I, I was like, let me search. What is it called? What iPhone. is what called? What is the iPhone, the smallest iPhone I 13 call? Uh, it's the mini. The mini. I searched it on Twitter and like it was all like trashing it. So I. <laughs> yeah. So you got the Zumba. Like, yeah, I, like, I don't just, like. Dude, you don't charge your fucking phone. Just charge it at night in a separate room. So you can sleep. That wouldn't work. I told you. I'm, I'm different. <laughs> I'm mobile. I'd get to it easily. <laughs> if I wanted it, I would get to it. Like another room isn't stopping me. I was like, oh, I want to go look at. But something. when you're in bed, you don't want to get out of I bed. Go, I want to go browse. <laughs> That's I'm why trying you're to not figure out, trying to figure out. The, Are you browsing before? I'm bed? trying to figure out the most remote uh, city in West Virginia. And it is I what? I think it's Elkins. Really? I've uh, been. Well, Elkins is two and a half hours from the nearest city with a hundred thousand or more. Okay. And it's like an hour and a half to the nearest city with twenty thousand or more, which is probably Damn. that's how I'm going off remoteness. That's fair. Yeah. 
But I'm sure they have like Walmarts and Starbucks. Doesn't matter. That's not very remote then. If you're on a remote island and they all have a you, Starbucks, all you got on your mind is just remotes. <laughs> yeah, dude. Oh, well, this remote's more, bigger than this remote. I'm worried about the wrong remotes. <laughs> it's a good meme. So, just start that up. This dude is worth. You're t- you're talking about smart TVs <laughs> living in Elkins. <laughs> Dude's worried about the wrong remote. <laughs> that could be wrong. I, I that was just the. F- I didn't finish the research. If someone else wants to do that for him, <laughs> <laughs> you gave him a great launching point. I'm going off of how far you are from the nearest cities with a like a semi significant amount of people. Okay. That's fair. <laughs> and if you can find one, you in are a different so state, bad when it comes to technology. You are too. You can't even figure out the new Photoshop layout. You probably get. I'm working on it right now. I'm crushing. But it is. I no. I couldn't. I I struggled. I tried to Photoshop that Pokey Reese thing, and I just gave up. Dude, I'm kind of shook at that umpire. I feel he bodied you. He didn't body. It was sad. No, it wasn't. Do you want to just? Are you trying to start beef with this dude? No, I just don't. That was just feel kind of bad. Um, how long have we been rolling for, Owen? Two, three hours? 45. Yeah, boys. We're getting good at this podcast yeah, shit. Incredible. <laughs> you can just watch the tape of this podcast and realize we're getting really good at it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> From start to finish, it's been good. <laughs> it's been good. Well, the thing is, like, we've been, what the, what's been separating us is uh, we've been taking time to, like, pre-write segments mm-hmm. uh, or just read headlines off uh, How did that work? Yeah. Well, why don't you read your best one? I already, I've read them all. I think I read them all. Sorry, man. Oh, oh you have some. Yeah. You want to help me with mine? Oh, here's yeah, one. Kyle. Uh, yeah. Let's actually, let's use it as a workshop. Yeah. Too. Here. Give the people a Try this peek. One. Texas pastor says gay people should be shot in the back of the, oh my God. Yeah. Shot in the back of the head in a shocking sermon. If you think this guy is mad now, just wait until he learns about the church. <laughs> he, he, he f- f- fucked in the back of the ass. <laughs> <laughs> what part of the ass did he fuck you? The back. The back. <laughs> I guess the back. I don't know. Dude, I fucked. Dude, I ass fucked this chick. I fucked the front of her ass. Oh, her pussy? Yeah. <laughs> Hell oh, yeah. Shit. Oh, and yeah, what are yours? Um, a 101 year old Dutch woman was reunited with her painting originally looted by Nazis. I am amazed. She said, I've wanted this for so long. I will cherish this every day for as long as I. (laughs) (laughs) Fuck. Honestly. Yeah. They should have just given it to a museum. Like, yeah. Um, Cherish it every day. You don't, you can't cherish a painting every day. I don't know. If you're that age, what, what do you have? You wake up and you cherish your paintings. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> I mean, I'm being serious. Like, what else are you going to do? Honestly, yeah, you start the morning would, like, off with a cream of wheat something. and then you cherish paintings. Yes. Oh, dude. Until when we your did that nighttime c- cream of wheat. Oh, my God. When we did that cereal bracket or the cereal thing we on the Brandon cereal. Walker show, Barstool Maine had the audacity to tweet it. That's the yeah. only time they promo us when we're on Brandon's show. Yeah, they know. Well, they know what it would cause. Yes. Um, and people were up in arms. And it's like, that's the thing we make fun of the most is having super opinionated takes on mm-hmm. cereal. Yeah, and we were just we were just hearing this. We were just saying shit. We started just. Saying <laughs> I shit. haven't had cereal. I've had like five cereals total in my life. None in the past ten years. I was just saying shit. I said that <laughs> the fruity pebbles is the equivalent of the Lord of the Rings trilogy. Yeah, and people were like, "Oh, that's fun. that actually makes sense." He's preaching. No, uh, it was, people were seething people because were, we ranked a, like a fruity. Ch- we, how we ranked fruity children's treats. That's right. But I, there was one dude up in arms. He was like, "Where the fuck is Dino Crunch?" I'm like, "What the <laughs> fuck are you talking about? Where's Dino Crunch?" We were so dude? busy like co- Cookie Crisp. Like, we, yeah, cookie, we were called racist. This one dude was like, uh, "This is the whitest shit ever." There was one meme cereal on there, Gorilla Munch, and this dude's like, "No way, Gorilla Munch is better than Cookie Crisp." Yeah. And it was like, fuck, uh, dude. Go check your, like, gas pipe. <laughs> go, yeah, dude. <laughs> go check your fucking gas pipe. Oh, man. <laughs> People were so up in arms. And then, like, there were some cereals not on there, like uh, O's, Honey O's. And there was just, those guys came out in, the of honey, the woodwork. Yeah. Really? Yeah. God damn. Yeah, but, yeah, I guess if you want, if we want to clip something, just, like, have a take on something that's, like, that's all you need. Yeah. Like when I mean, you're eating a PB and J. We definitely figured that out a while ago. <laughs> when you're eating a PB and J, do you want, do you, does your sandwich have the jelly or the peanut butter on top? That, yeah. 
It's got to be jelly on top. 350 replies, all negative. Every single one. <laughs> <laughs> you can that's, never, that's how it works, you can dude. never be right. And it's so awesome. It's all, I you know, love it. It's that you crack the code on interaction. Yeah. Actually, uh, I had a typo on our Pokey Reese tweet and, uh, the first word uh, wishing. And I said, wising. And somebody's like, wising, huh? Yeah. Uh, just, uh, that's a key to interaction. If you have yeah, a, just fuck it up. a tweet out an opinionated take with a typo, YouTubers, oh. YouTubers figure that out early on. If you like mispronounce a word, you get, it drives the engagement. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. A lot of pokey tubers do that intentionally. Oh yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think yeah. hundreds lined the streets for the first ever Athens pride parade. The Georgian city is embracing a cornerstone of its Grecian namesakes culture, but fucking men. <laughs> <laughs> that is like a cornerstone of their culture. It really was. It's in oh, this all is their Athens, literature. Georgia? Athens. Yes. Athens, Georgia. Uh, Justin, I, yeah, go. No, no, no. I, I didn't know Athens, Georgia had a large gay community. Uh, this was their first ever. Oh, okay. Pride parade. Some places are sneaky, sneaky gay. Like, if you look up gayest places. Yeah, you tell me. I'm interested. <laughs> 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 it's like all Fayette, 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 Fayette. it actually Loki. almost traces uh to everywhere Kyle's what's, a, been. what's a sneaky gay city albuquerque i can see that i'm thinking of like from like a conservative state okay oh I, no there's a country Conway, arkansas so fort lauderdale's number one berlin germany amsterdam wait fort lauderdale fort La- i wouldn't say i would say number one very conservative san francisco four fort uh, lauderdale brighton what? madrid spain i'm trying there's one Oh, Tel Aviv. Really? Yes. Very, very, very gay. And very gay friendly. Huh. Huh. Yeah, I didn't think Tel Aviv would be one. Neither, neither would I. New York's 11 on this list. Boys, we gotta, gotta do nothing what about that. What was number that. one? Fort Lauderdale was number yeah, one. No, it's not. It's Yeah, that's shocking to me. What is the metrics? Step aside, San Fran in New York. There's a new queen in town. <laughs> There's over a hundred LGBTQ themed <laughs> establishments. Do they think they hate their lives? <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to like uh, meet the editor of this. Yeah. So Albuquerque's the new queen of gay no, town. Fort Lauderdale oh, is Fort the new Lauderdale. queen. Yeah. Uh, it's like isn't it like they have a gay mayor, Dean? college kid USA. Yeah, which I guess is gay. Can't mm-hmm. get enough of the beautiful beach, golden sands, sporty tournaments. And flamboyant sunbathers. Sporty tournaments. Sebastian Street Beach. That's a tough one for people. Did they people say tournaments or tournaments? Because tournaments is the gay way. To tournaments. Say. Yeah, it's gay. <laughs> Why? I didn't say tournaments. You want to say tournaments? Oh, hey. bro, hey, <laughs> bro. Hey, and the pod. Uh, I'm pissed. Wait, you. <laughs> oh no, I'm rolling in 4K, Kyle. Oh, and he got caught. <laughs> oh, <no>. I. <laughs> sucks that we were matching this whole episode <laughs> it's a lot different when we're just on the yak and there's some some oh, beef dude. to break it up yeah and let's get let's buy these because these are actually really cool mm-hmm. let's get some more of these yeah, yeah. uh justin yes. bieber announced he was diagnosed with ramsey hunt syndrome and uh pessimist noticed half of his face was paralyzed <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's the best one oh, of the day. Man. That's the that's best a, one of the that's day. That's actually very good. That's the best. You one. wasted that at the wrong. Yeah, <laughs> that's the best one yeah. of the day. People exited out after whatever. Oh Nick, yeah. yeah, Nick's pokey tuber talk. No, no one's gonna hear that. That's the best one of the day. <laughs> Add w- that to the dub to Owen today. I mean, you're exactly your reply to what I'm gonna say. No, you're just gonna say like, no, that's a new untold story. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hey, is that story old or told? <laughs> Thank you.